Hi BTN, my name is Ruby and I've been nominated as a finalist for The Young Archie. Hi BTN, my name is Alison and I've been nominated as a finalist for The Young Archie Book Prize. Hi, I'm Jude and I've been nominated as a finalist for Young Archie. Yep, these kids are talented artists who are all in the running to win one of the most prestigious junior art prizes in the country. The Young Archie is a competition run by the Art Gallery of New South Wales and has been recognising the next generation of artists since 2013. But the competition it stems from, the Archibald Prize, goes back a lot further than that. It started way back when a journalist and art enthusiast called J.F. Archibald left a bunch of money in his will to set up the Archibald Prize. And 100 years ago, in 1921, the first competition was held. Since then, it's become the most prestigious prize in Aussie art. And to be eligible, artists have to paint a portrait of someone who's well known. Like an actor, or musician, or politician, or even another artist. Like this year's winning piece. For the young Archie, entrants also have to paint a portrait. Except it has to be of someone they know, and who's special to them. So, let's find out a little more. My piece was basically created with coloured pencils, oil pastels, paint, and it's called My Light, and it's about Lily here. Well, I chose to um, paint my great-grandpa because it's about someone who's important to me. I see him, like, I used to see him every weekend. He, um, he passed away, actually. So he was just kind of important to me, and I had a really nice photo. The subject is my dad in his army gear and um, it's called My Hero Dad. I think it was just because I was really, really proud of him because he's always gone away for so long, but he's always ended up making time for us whenever he comes back, and I just really love him. For me, I've always tried to make my pieces really about capturing the thing or the person not necessarily for realism, but for their personality, for how I see them and how they portray themselves. Basically, my inspiration for the piece was Lily. Her personality, her behaviours, her mannerisms, just her as a person. And so, how long have you been doing art? As far back as I can remember, really. I've always loved painting and drawing, and I think it really comforts me. I guess since primary school, I guess, like, since I started art class. We've practically been artists since we were very little. We've always called ourselves artists. We always hoped to call ourselves artists. We could probably be artists since we could pick up a pencil. Like, it was just a hobby that never really went away for us. And why did you want to enter the Young Archies? Well, Mum mentioned it one day when I was just painting outside, and I thought maybe I'd give it a go. I didn't really. Um, <laughs> I think it's just, we just kind of painted everybody, it's everyone painted and my teacher, she just chose the best one and just put it in. We always thought of the Young Archie competition, we never wanted it to be about winning and we didn't want it to be about beating other people, we just used it as an excuse to create something. And what would you say to any young artists out there who might also want to get involved in art? I'd just say, be yourself. And don't be afraid to try new things, like push yourself out of your comfort zone because you never know what might happen. Well, I don't consider myself like a good artist. I think a lot of other people in my classes have better ones. I think uh, it was only really by accident that I made a good art piece. So I think just try it and make something good. No matter what people say, just do art because you love it and always appreciate your art because it's yours.